Okay, we talked about drying. Let's talk more about oh drying. <laughs> As we segue, because yeah. we're going to give you help for all the things menopause. Um, if you've noticed your skin changing, along with just about everything else during menopause, a few tweaks to your skincare routine might help you out. So here with tips to tackle the most common menopausal skin concerns is Chauvinalaka Lacka Valley. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. That was so good. So good. <laughs> All right, shows. let's jump into the skin care. For us menopausal women, what would you recommend for dry and itchy skin? You know, Tracy, when menopause happens, it's so much more than uh, hot flashes, right? Yes. And I'm embarrassed to say that's what I thought it was. But with this decrease in estrogen, a huge decrease, there's so many changes we see in our skin, like dryness, like a loss of elasticity, maybe mm. acne, maybe hyperpigmentation. Mm -hmm. But this segment's really focused on helping women transition through this phase gracefully. No more anti-aging, no more reversing, but just truly embracing this time in our life, but doing it with a little bit of skincare to help. Well, I love that. It's a good perspective. And the reason why you thought it was all hot flashes is because that's all we ever hear about. Yes, exactly. Right? So we're trying to do like everything inside of menopause. Let's start with dry and itchy skin. Absolutely. So first focus on your cleansers. A lot of our cleansers dry, are very dry. Yes. They strip our skin of essential oils. Mm -hmm. I love the Pause Hydrating Cleanser. This is a line created specifically for this menopausal phase in our lives. Yeah. Uh, it is a cream cleanser, which I think is a little bit better than gel and uh, foam cleansers. Mm -hmm. It also has strengthening ingredients. You need to look for these, like niacinamide. Mm -hmm. It has some really great fatty oils in there to also hydrate. Mm -hmm. It's so good. I've been actually using it, and it works. And if you're looking for something a little bit more budget-friendly, CeraVe Hydrating Cleanser also yes. has some strengthening and hydrating ingredients, too. So good for you. Are these products also about itchy, yeah. dry? Okay. So when we think about hydration, we think about moisturizers. Mm -hmm. I love the Vichy Neo Vidal line because it's created moisturizers specifically for this phase. So it gives us many okay. different benefits we're looking for. Nice. Um, and they have a day and night cream for perimenopause and a day and night cream for postmenopause. And I'm so excited about this because they're just curating to really treat us in those little phases in our lives. Mm -hmm. And, you know, they went so far to even create a cooling moisturizer. Okay. Um, this is the perimenopause overnight. Ooh. All right? It's very, very refreshing. Yeah, it smells good too. Right? It feels nice. good. It doesn't have to be rich and thick. Right. Which I think is what we usually associate with dry skin. Nice. They also have a lip and eye treatment for, because that's where we get really crepey easily because right. it's so delicate in that area. And they just also launched their um, their Menopause 5 by Serum. So they got you all checked out for this phase in your life. We love that. And I love that the audience is going to be getting both of these, all of you. Yes. So enjoy those. that their skin isn't as plump or firm as it used to be, what can we consider? Well, listen, that framework, that collagen in our skin that holds it up, that makes it look voluminous, yeah. it's decreasing. Right. It's normal. So we're going to look for some collagen-boosting ingredients and okay. some ingredients that are going to help our skin keep producing new skin cells. Right. Because when we get older, our skin slows this process down and we're left with older, duller skin cells. Right. Okay? Okay. So think about phytoestrogens. These mm -hmm. are just estrogens from plants that help mim mimic estrogen in our bodies, can help okay. produce collagen. Paula's Choice has an exclusive line, the phytoestrogen renewal serum and body treatment, because you don't want to forget about this part of us. That's right. right? Uh, and don't forget about your retinol. We talk about it here yes. so much. Retinol, 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 retinol. What does retinol do? Well, what it does is it actually helps that process yeah. renew, uh, renew our skin cells. So it's oh, like that okay. fitness instructor telling you, keep going, keep going, right. keep doing it. You can do it. You can do it, yeah. right? So our skin stays new and young. It's one of the most recommended dermatologist ingredients out there, I find. Okay. You use retinol at night. Mm -hmm. But if you have dry and itchy skin that you might have because of menopause, start yeah. with a lower concentration. The yeah. Ordinary has some really great options. This is $10, okay? Oh, good. Yeah. Yeah. And this is a 0.2 retinol and squalene. So yeah. you have the retinol, which is going to help with that skin, mm -hmm. but you have squalene, which helps nourish at the same time. You're looking okay. for these different ingredients. Is that, and is this a serum? It is a serum. And the, the reason I said good, some people would be like, $10 isn't good, $1.99 is good. When it comes to serums, you're <laughs> exactly. paying like $50, $60. Exactly. So $10 actually is good for yes. that situation. These are all serums to really yes. treat our aging concerns. Good. And they go in between cleansers and moisturizers. 
Okay, let's talk about hyperpigmentation uh, yeah. and age spots. Yes, okay, yeah. so women that are lighter will experience collagen loss sooner. We yeah. have a few more years, but yeah. there is hyperpigmentation and age spots. Yes. So you want to treat it with a vitamin C. I feel like this is the superhero ingredient. Again, dermatologists recommend. It yes. helps preventing hyperpigmentation, mm -hmm. treating it, helps protect from the sun that causes hyperpigmentation. It also helps stimulate collagen. It literally does a little bit of everything, okay. but really helps protect against hyperpigmentation. This How is one am of I them. not using a vitamin C yet. I've Yikes. been telling you. I I'm telling know. you. I'm going to start <laughs> <Okay>. tomorrow. <laughs> Perfect. So that's what we need. Yeah. And you know what? We've also been talking about sunscreen. Yes. Our skin is getting thinner right now. Yes. So collagen destruction is happening mm -hmm. um, as well as we're getting more dry hyperpigmentation is happening. You need to start protecting your skin because mm -hmm. the sun does damage. But if you want a sunscreen that actually protects against that sun damage, yeah. you need to look for this symbol here. It is the UVA symbol with a circle on it. Okay. This means that you're getting protection from the sun rays specifically that cause that skin damage. Okay. Not all sunscreens do that. Okay, so the UVA with the circle. Yeah. I want to see if this is going to look purple or gray on me. Oh, it's going to look Because clear. as a black girl, it is so difficult to find a sunscreen that actually goes on. Oh, wow, and disappears. Look at that. And it's light. Yeah, right? it's yes. very light. So I'm actually, I'm impressed. Yeah, this That's is the La Roche Plus Antilios 50 Plus okay. SPF. They have a huge collection of sunscreens, one of my favorites for very sure. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, acne prone skin. Okay. Because it comes back. <laughs> You thought it was gone, but it's back. What do you mean, Joe? I'm hope right. I'm Come hoping on. that most of us don't have to deal with it. If we yeah. do, retinol does do a little bit of work. Think about also using a, a resurfacing serum okay. instead of using those strong topical ingredients that we used to use as a teenager. Mm -hmm. Our skin is sensitive; it might be dry. It's not the time to do that. Got it. Um, this has exfoliating acids in it, which will help remove dead skin cells, unclog our pores. Okay. But I love this proteiny power peptide by the Drunk Elephant because it has peptides in it. Mm -hmm. You know what peptides are? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so they're like the it ingredient right now. Uh -huh. They make up collagen. So not only does this help with acne, it's going to help boost your collagen at the same time. Good. Good. That's a hard working product right? there. And, and I have also something. Have, yes, you want to talk about we this do. one? Yeah. Because come on. Wouldn't oh, you use this and scare your family? Because that's what I do. Ah. <laughs> ah. Right? I could go around the kitchen corner and be like, ah. <laughs> But what is it really for? <laughs> well, the great thing is you only have to apply it for a few minutes a day, and you can scare your family during that time. <laughs> but the red light helps yeah. with collagen boosting, and then the blue so light cool. helps we with... We just show them. Yeah. The See? Blue, it's like radiating. It's beautiful. And the blue light helps with... Uh, dealing with acne and inflammation. Okay. Yeah, so you can have treatments like this in the dermatologist's office. Yeah. This is an at-home product you can use uh -huh. that has a little softer, uh, little, the results are a little bit softer, right. but it works. The results are incredible. This is by yeah. Dr. Dennis Gross. And I promise you that if you have teenage kids or in their early 20s, they will just think this is funny. <laughs> like, just surprise them. Come on, <laughs> keep it light, people. Um, I want to talk about this one because Ooh. it's like, it's not a, we're not going to say it's a treatment for hot flashes, no. but what is it? Shows? It's actually just a refreshing cooling mist by Indeed. It's the okay. menopause spray. Yeah. I'll, I'll do it. You can give me a spray. Oh, I can. Okay. Spritz. It has cucumber in it, as mm. well as lotus flower extract. Yeah. And it just gives you a few seconds of refreshing yes. uh, like, and cooling down, because I hear that it makes you feel like you're going to combust. Internal inferno. Exactly. Yes. Exactly. Shows, thanks so 